Hi, welcome to the Double Drew Kitchen. My name is Christina Franklin, and I'm going to show you a couple of things that we're going to make today that you can make at home as well. Now we're going to make gonna... our signature smoked trout dip. So we take our smoked trout, we actually smoke it in-house here, and we smoke it with hickory nut chips. It takes about 15 minutes to smoke, and then we let it cool, and then we're going to get ready to make our trout dip. So what we want to do is we want to take our trout, and we want to take the skin off. You can, you can eat the skin on regular trout, but not on this one. We want to make sure that that skin's off because it's a little, it can be a little slippery. So we're just going to break that apart in our bowl. So it's got nice, some nice, good flakes to it. You want to have some, you don't want it to be completely mushed up, but you want to have some nice flakes because it tastes really nice with that. We're going to add our trout. Keep on just picking it apart. You can also put this in a food processor. It works really well. It gets a little bit more um, tasty. So I like to have it all kind of flaky. Take some of our smoked trout. We're gonna take a good bunch of scallions or green onions, whatever you prefer, or fresh chives. Take a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper to that. And then we're gonna take some of our cream cheese. Nice dollop of cream cheese in that. And what we wanna do is make sure that that cream cheese is nice and soft. You can leave it out on the counter for a little bit, like 10, 15 minutes, just to get nice and soft. To make sure that when you make it, it's all nice. And what we typically do is once this is all made, we like to let it sit for a few hours just so all those flavors develop in there and to make sure that everything is incorporated. Some things are just better the next day. And this is one of those things that's better the next day. So once you mix that all up, it is going to be looking like this guy right here. And this is really nice to go with um, cucumber cups or carrots or some nice grilled bread on a nice sunny afternoon. So this is how you make my smoke trap dip. 